Oh, hello, and welcome to Video Jug. A few moments ago, this happened. That was my girlfriend's highly regarded pet chinchilla, Raul. So he's dead. I'm not that bothered. My girlfriend is. I'd probably better learn how to cry. Consider the things that make you feel sad, such as music, and use this to your advantage. Pick a song that makes you feel at your very lowestness. I've chosen Total Eclipse of the Heart by Bonnie Tyler. When you want to cry, think of the song. It's heart rendering harmonics. It saw his sins. Turn round, bright eyes. The tears. They will flow. <laughs> Similarly, you can use Stanislavski's emotion memory technique, where you relive sad events in your own life to stir up emotions. This is one of the most important things professional actors learn, as it helps you role play realistically. Darling, I'm so sorry. I'm now thinking about the death of my dog, Darren. I never cry at funerals, but Raoul's death is my fault, and I should try my hardest to look sincerely hurt. Here are three simple techniques to make your eyes water. Find something to stare at, such as boobs, and force yourself not to blink for 30 seconds. I'm yawning over and over. For some reason, it's your eyes water. <laughs> no, 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 stop. Shh, shh. This is Raoul's wake. My girlfriend has asked me to share some thoughts. I'm all out of sad memories and haven't got the energy to act. So I'm gonna try some props to get the tears flowing. Nasal vapor rub. At the appropriate moment, just rub a little under the eyes. Tweezers. Give a good yank on any sensitive hairs and savor the pain. Or onions. Get a good old dose of simpropanthyl S oxide in your peepers. Raul Alessandro Diego Joaquin Phoenix was a very little bundle of <laughs> Why? Why? Why?